let's look around ourselves what are we doing a student has a dream to become a great engineer but we are forcing him to take up courses which are not appropriate for his dreams person is dreaming to become an actor and we are forcing him to become an engineer we are imposing our ideas on children is it really appropriate we must understand that education is the sole weapon in the hands of students to transform their future through education they can become what they wish to aspire they can achieve their dreams they can become what they want to become but in most of the cases we are imposing our structured thinking our structured programs on students we are forcing them to do what we wish them to study it should be the other way around we have to enable our students to dream to aspire to understand what should be their future to meet with some good people and decide about their ideals decide about their role models to decide about their future but we are not doing it from small classes to higher education from schooling to universities everywhere we are forcing the students to think in a particular line we are evaluating ranking the students we are asking you are not good you are poor you are below average how do we judge these things a student who is scoring now 40% marks doesn't need scolds he needs counseling and we have to understand him the student has to be understood by the teachers by the parents we have to understand what are the aspirations of the students and we have to provide him required support required required counseling so that the student can take up the courses can pick up those sectors where he is really excellent he might be able to score 90% in those sectors this is a you know mad rush people are just looking at each other following what everybody is doing small children 2 years 3 years 4 years are forced to go to schools and from this age they are forced to face the competition of life this is the age when we have to nurture them develop them we, this is the age when we have to give them very high touch support emotional solidarity even if we send them to a play school we should look at the play school environment there should not be any competition the children of tender age need attention need love need care so we should focus on those things and coming to schools and colleges and universities everywhere we must understand that the educational systems should be designed to be flexible enough to transform the students into a very uh, committed person who is really thinking about society thinking about the nation and giving it the first priority i find people often talking they want to take, do engineering because somebody else has taken engineering we must make the students clear what are the various courses and how to achieve their dreams through those courses